Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon and welcome back to my reaction to episode 5 of the Clone Wars. Now, last time we left off, we had just seen the Malevolence destroyed, General Grievous escaped, they rescued Padme, and everybody was happy. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see where we go, I'm assuming it's going to just be another short story that starts off brand new. Um, so yeah, why don't we get into it, as always, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, enjoy. As usual. You're listening to the Grand Army of the Republic broadcast, <laughs> the voice of the Outer Rim. This next one goes out to the Mutt Jumpers at the 224th. I like that. I like the idea that there's radio or some sort of space radio. Fives? <laughs> uh, shouldn't you be watching your scope, Heavy? Yeah, let's take a look. Hmm, what do you know? It's not going to stay all clear for long, I bet. You best check 101 times. I'll sleep after we find General Grievous. Clone intelligence spotted him in the Balmora system, but that was weeks ago. Since then, he vanished. Well, unlike you, maybe he's getting some much needed rest. Excuse me, General. Incoming transmission from Commander Cody. Commander Cody. General Skywalker. Cody, how goes the inspections? The tracking station I know that one. Is fully operational. Captain Rex and I proceeded to the outpost. The First mention of Captain Rex that I've heard. Report back once you've arrived. Copy that. Cody out. Good man, Matt Cody. Sir, incoming media shower. Raise the shield. You wanted excitement, Heavy. Right. <laughs> media shower. <laughs> I got a feeling it's not a meteor shower. Wouldn't really want to live on that planet. Especially not now. What the? Oh, what are they? I've not seen them before. They've disabled the beacon. Get a message to the fleet. We have to warn. Oh, they're dead. Oh. Four clones escaped, Captain. They don't matter. Hardwire the all clear signal and contact General Grievous. Hmm. So, clones who, um, sorry, droids who can actually do something successfully, that's new. We shut down the alarm and turned on the all clear signal. Excellent! Keep that signal alive! I don't want the Republic to find out we're coming! What do we do without the Sarge? The Reg Manual says the next. Wait, wait! Did you hear that? Yeah, what is that? It doesn't sound like droids. Ooh. Don't forget about those giant eels. Yeah, I've never seen <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> what the hell was that? You were saying? That was an eel. Now, now that's why we have the regulation not to go outside. Let's move before it comes back. I have a bad feeling about this. Welcome to Rishi, Commander. As you can see, the outpost is operating at peak efficiency. Thank you for visiting, and have a safe trip back. <laughs> it's about overacting. We need to inspect the base just the same. Ah, uh, there is no need. Everything is fine and fully operational. <laughs> it's no good. Their comlinks are on a different scramble set. I'll signal them with this flare. 
take us to the sergeant in command. Roger, roger. A droid attack flare? There you go. What the heck are you doing? Relax. Just as I thought. Looks like one of those new commando droids. That flare must have come from commando the Commando droids. How do they not get hit? We're firing them from behind as well. Oh, yeah, there's a grenade. Was easy. Nice shot. The name's Rex. Ah, uh, hello, Rex. You'll call me Captain or Sir. Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> I'm Commander Cody, your new boss. My designation is Trooper 27 5555, sir. We call him Fives. I'm heavy. This is Echo. Where's your sergeant? Dead, sir. We're all that's left. Looks like we got ourselves a batch of shinies, Commander. Shinies, sir? That's right. Your armor. It's shiny and new. Just like you. Hmm. Sir, me and my batches are trained and ready. We'll take back our post, shiny or not. There's hope for you yet, rookie. What is that? Unit 26, is that you? <laughs> roger, roger. You sound strange. Is something <laughs> wrong with your vocabulator? Roger, roger. Take off your helmet. Let me see your faceplate. Roger, roger. This is never gonna work. Mm. Whoa. Roger, roger. <laughs> I can lead by example. Oh. Oh. Oh, they got swords. <laughs> nice. One target of interest in this sector, Camino. It's the closest thing we clones have to a home. Today we fight for more than the Republic. Today we fight for all our brothers back home. Understood? Sir, sir yes, yes, sir. I think we can even the odds a bit, Commander. Especially since they don't know we're here. This one here is mine. <laughs> <laughs> big gun doesn't make a big man. <laughs> Reinforcements reporting. Open up. Didn't say please. <laughs> Whoa, get up. <laughs> Surely they'd realize something was wrong by now. How about the old clear signal? Is the base still transmitting? Yes, sir. If something were wrong, Cody would contact us. What is the status of the base? Uh, we've run into some difficulties. There seem to be a few clones left, sir. Then wipe them out! We can't let a few puny clones stop us! 
You're gonna manually detonate it. Let's move. Mm. I know what I have to do. I don't like your tone, rookie. It's all about the uh, the new guys proving their worth. So yeah, just there's so much more than just mindless innumerous drones or numerous drones yeah. not drones clones Good job, guys. Thanks to heavy. Gunships. Getting off this crater, boys. On behalf of the Republic, we thank you for your valiant service. And we honor your comrade's sacrifice. Your new unit is lucky to have you. I'd be proud to fight beside you anytime, anywhere. Congratulations. You're not shinies anymore. With all due respect, sir, we failed our mission. We don't deserve this honor. No. If it weren't for you, the Republic wouldn't have learned of the Separatist invasion until it was too late. You showed me mm. something today. You're exactly the kind of men I need in the 501st. Sir! Yes, sir! Oh, he's going to give him the 501st. Okay, so that was my reaction to the fifth episode of The Clone Wars. Uh, it was nice to see an episode where there wasn't one Jedi involved in the main story. Um, they just let it go completely with the clones. It was nice to see some um, actual droids who could actually do something. You know, they weren't completely useless. They were quite competent. Um, and yeah, it was basically showing you that the clones, you know, they did made sacrifices. You know, they were honourable and I like that. I like the way that the, the developing the clone characters, it certainly is making me more attached to them than I was before the, in the films. They were just, they were throwaway, um, you know, figures, as you say, expendable. I really enjoyed that. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see where we go from here now. So yeah, if you enjoyed it too, then please let me know. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and check back for my next reaction.